at the southernmost tip of Africa. And this is where the Indian and the Atlantic Ocean meets. This is so cool. <laughs> Hi guys, if you're new around here, we are Craig and Shantz and this is our YouTube channel. At the moment we're busy with a road trip around South Africa, or I should say a very unplanned road trip because we actually booked our accommodation for tonight just yesterday. We are on the way to Hermanus and we are going to take you on a road trip with us. We have some exciting detours planned. It's going to take us about six hours. We are super excited to see some amazing views. Here we go. So, it's been a good start to the morning. I forgot a USB cable at the Airbnb, but the kind host is actually bringing it to the petrol station for us, which is very nice. So you see, coffee saves the day. Luckily we stopped. <laughs> <laughs> Come to the Caymans River Railway Bridge. It's pretty cool because you can see the railway going through the mountain, through that tunnel there, and the coolest railway bridge on the ocean. It's a very cool spot if you're driving the N2 between Nasna and George. It's a nice viewpoint. I think you can take a bit of a walk down as well. After this, we're gonna turn around and go back to Wilderness. We're gonna turn up to the Seven Passes Road, which is gonna be quite scenic and we're quite excited for. <laughs> We just drove from Wilderness to George, we're in George now, but we took the old road, it's called Seven Passes, but on that stretch you only see two of the passes. That road was actually completed in 1883. People stopped using it, I think, in the 1950s when the National Highway was built then too. It was such a cool drive and I actually forgot my brother got married on that stretch a few years ago. My sister-in-law just sent me a photo. <laughs> it was really worth it just to take that short little detour. So now we're in George, we're gonna get something to eat here and then we'll hit the road again. We're about 150 k's before the turn off where we'll go down to Cape Regalis. And I'm driving. And Chantal is driving, <laughs> in case you guys were asking if she drives. <laughs> I'm DJ, camera guy, navigator. Let's hope you do a good job. <laughs> We're at the southernmost tip of Africa. We are standing on the map of Africa. It's really cool. Right in front of us there's a monument and it also shows you where the Indian Ocean and the Atlantic meets. So the monument is actually a map of Africa as seen here, but uh, it is beautiful. It's an awesome place to visit. That is the way Indian and Atlantic meets. of the ocean here is just phenomenal and just the fact that we can stand at the point where the Indian Ocean meets the Atlantic Ocean is very cool definitely worth the trip on the way to the southernmost tip monument you'll drive past this beautiful beautiful lighthouse we aren't going to go up and explore that because we need to get to Hermanus and it's already two o'clock and it's about a two-hour drive out of Hadmanis and it is so so beautiful check out the mountain yeah there's a lot of road work so we are about eight kilometers away but uh, it's gonna take us a while now yeah. we have arrived 
out in the mornings and our place to stay. It's not an Airbnb. But it is an Airbnb. Oh, it is an Airbnb. Welcome, we have arrived. So in the pictures on booking.com and Airbnb, because it's listed on both, it looked like the shower was in the bedroom. We don't know if that's, if it was maybe just a trick, but let's, <laughs> let's check it out. It totally is. <laughs> bedroom. We relaxed for a little bit here at our new Airbnb and we think we're gonna go out and find ourselves some dinner now. Go explore the main road in Amanis. Mm. There's beautiful views. So we just booked our accommodation for the next four nights and we're very excited for that. So you better watch the next video to find out where we're going for four nights. I'm excited, where, where <laughs> we going? Back home. <laughs> cool, okay, so let's go see what Amanis has to offer. I'm hungry. Mm. So we were heading out to get some dinner, but then we saw these beautiful views and we just had to stop. And we can definitely feel it's the Atlantic Ocean now because this wind coming off it is quite chilly. We just saw a whale just out there, not too far, which is pretty cool. It is just very windy right now. looking for a restaurant to have a bit of a dinner in Amanis. So there's like an entertainment square with restaurants and people just sitting out, checking the view of the ocean. We're sitting at the wooden barrel and we found a special here, calamari, hay, chimps and rice. And, and it just arrived, we're starving. And it looks amazing. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're gonna eat. We had such a yummy dinner and then we walked around and look what I just found. Dessert? Sushi. We actually gonna head home now. It's eight o'clock at night and the sun just sets. It's so light. We are so not used to this, but it feels quite early still. But we're gonna head home. We had such a long day on the road and I think we'll see you guys again in the morning. Good morning, it's 6 30 and yeah. we're actually out and about. It's we're going on cool. a cliff walk. Yeah. We'll show you a bit more of Hermanus. <laughs> and we decided to make the most of our time here because we're only here for one night, which was last night. Weather's nice, let's do it. Yeah. Harmonis you can do a lot of nature activities so we are walking the cliff park now and we saw in our Airbnb's little book that she left for us lots of other hikes that you can do wine farm tours and shark cage diving in a town that's close by Hans by it is the capital of the great white shark in the world that is crazy so for us, one night is enough here, but if you come here and you want to do all of those activities, we suggest that you actually stay a few more nights. 
It is beautiful here though. We had such a lovely stay, although it was short here in Hermanus. This Airbnb was really nice. I know I mentioned the shower being in the bedroom, but that shower is one of the most amazing showers we have ever used. It had like these six jets coming out and the water pressure from the spa. It was really nice. So we all packed up and I think we're going to see some penguins now at So we've just So we just <coughs> Sorry. Yes. One sweetie again. One sweetie. There's long stretches of road, we don't see any people, not a lot of cars. Yeah. So make sure you've filled up that and you've gone to the bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> Sushi! We just booked our accommodation for the next four nights. Yeah. Ah! <laughs> um, 